universalist church of the secular uh, atheist Jew persuasion. So it's nice to feel a little more at home. Um, you know, I was, this was back in the time when the Virginia was still part of the South before it had been completely annexed by DC. Um, and I know how important it is to have this kind of secular community, especially when you are surrounded by people who often view you as being morally suspects just because of your beliefs. Um, so I feel very lucky to break bread with y'all in these trying times. Um, for those of you who have never heard me talk about luck, I'm sorry, your luck has run out. Uh, <laughs> it was a good run. I had to close out sometime. I have personally been obsessed with luck for about a decade now. I've been developing a new way to teach about luck that I think helps people avoid compulsive production and burnout. Um, I also care deeply about value-centered community organizing, especially amongst skeptics and non-believers who often feel uncomfortable talking about values. Okay, I am here to praise Dr. Peter Hotez and his book, Blue Marble Health. Uh, I've had to write this to keep it to 10 minutes. I have loved dogs, cats, and most animals all of my life, and I have anguished over the cruelty often committed against them. But I've realized that some cruelty results when they become so numerous that they are easy prey to abusers and when they unintentionally cause annoyance to disturbed people. So I lobbied Mayor Brown unsuccessfully for a pooper scooper ordinance, humiliating my children, and finally succeeded under Mayor White. But he immediately reversed it by approving the practice of TNR, trap, neuter, reabandonment of feral cats in our city. Those cats are free to spread poop all over the city. The toxoplasmosis oocytes, which only reproduce in the intestines of felids and shed in their feces, pollute our yards, parks, and waterways. They bring miscarriage and death to wildlife, marine mammals, zoo animals, and pregnant or immunocompromised humans. Ay, de este momento, y en los colores que se me desvisten, poco a poco y descubriéndome en silencio, en que tu silencio y en tu nombre que se me va derritiendo, que se me va con el tiempo, que se me va muriendo, que se me va muriendo y en la mano eterna que me alegra el alma y los párpados, los párpados de amor, ay de amor. Cuando el paisaje se llenó de vida y se puso desafiante en cada metro y me tuvo preso y en la claridad de la belleza esa tinta inevitable 